prayer is the most powerful force in the whole world. Make it a part of your life. I use the rosary a lot when I travel. It's a prayer that you can pray as a whole car or just as yourself silently. Use it to strengthen your family search. Every day after dinner we would gather as a family, all 12 of us, and recite the rosary. And what that did was, not only did it, of course, focus us on the Lord, but it gathered us together as a family, it strengthened us, and it helped us to be open, like Mary, to God's call in our lives. The family is under tremendous pressure, but our families are, and they must continue to be, our future. It is particularly beautiful when we use such prayers as the family rosary with its meditations on the life of Christ and Mary, his blessed mother. Every Hail Mary that uh, I'm saying, that's a moment that Virgin Mary is talking to Jesus about me or about my family. Our seminarians and I have worked out a mission uh, to go into rural villages based on the joyful mysteries of the rosary. And we talk about saying yes to God, uh, visiting those in need, celebrating the birth of our Lord in our own world, presenting the best that we are, and the, the search for God uh, and, and His Son in our own lives. Prayer, all prayer, by all peoples and races and creeds, is just talking to the good God who made us all and loves us all. We try to bring the love of our Son right to our people, to the dying, the triple, the mental, the lepers. And it's so beautiful to see what she is seeing their life. Thanking him for all his works and asking him for all the blessings that we need. The family who prays together stays together. Family that prays together stays together. The family that prays together stays together.